Hey everyone, how you doing? So, um, yeah, as you can see by the title, this is an unboxing video of my new GoPro 3 action camera. Uh, this is the silver edition. And uh, I've been after one of these for a while and was even considering getting a cheaper model. Um, but I always, well, I normally try and go for the best I, I can afford kind of thing and I kind of really needed one of these cameras. So I managed to get one uh, really for really 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 good price so um, so yeah I've also ordered um, a 32 gig uh, class 10 micro SD card and a microphone as well however uh, they haven't arrived yet so I can't unbox them and I might just do a quick video to show you them when I eventually get them but um, so yeah this is going to be a look at the Hero 3 the reason I got this by the way is um, I bought a, when I got my new job I bought a motorbike to get to work and back and um, I'm traveling like every single day, um, more, you know, like all the time. And I get to see some pretty uh, cool things sometimes when I'm riding, and a lot of stupid things as well. And I've thought that it'd be cool to do some moto vlogging. Uh, I don't really have that much time at the moment to be doing loads of spider videos. And I thought, well, rather than finding time to stand and talk about my spiders, I could talk about them while traveling to and from work and things like that. So. Um, so yeah, let's crack on with the unboxing anyway. So uh, I have already opened this by the way, but due to technical problems I had to kind of re-upload it. The file was corrupt for some reason. Um, and it wouldn't like load it properly, so I, you know, sound was off. I thought I'd re-upload it and hopefully we wouldn't have any problems. Um, so yeah, here's a look at the, the box. Um, I'm not going to go into too much detail with this. If you know about action cameras, you know that this is kind of like the best one to get. Um, apart from the different colour, there is a white one, uh, the silver one and the black one. The black one is the best, the white one is the most basic and the silver one is the intermediate one, I suppose. Um, and I went with the silver because I wasn't kind of willing to pay an extra 100 quid or whatever it is just for a different colour and the extra features that you get with a black one didn't really bother me too much so um, I decided to go with the silver. So uh, yeah this is the, the outside of the box, there isn't too much on this box actually it basically just shows you how to take the camera off and to do that at the back there were these two little clips so you squeeze them in and the camera will come forward. Oops. And there it is, it's very small, really, really light as well, which is nice. Um, and I'll have a look at that in just a minute. And now in the actual, in the actual box here, you get a user, user manual, which of course I will actually be reading this um, because there's a lot of stuff in it that I kind of need to, to know. Um, of course I have some GoPro stickers. I will probably put one of them on like my bike or something like that. I won't put them on my helmet I don't think because I don't want to cover up any defects or anything. My helmet doesn't have any defects but you know just in case. Um, again uh, some more um, instruction things um, and then a quick start guide. I think this will be the one that will appeal to me actually because it looks like it's more step by step and you know. So yeah, but there's pretty uh you know, nice bit of literature there and some stickers. And then if you open up this, as you can see there's like a little crossy thing. Open that up. Nice down camera. <laughs> and in here you get uh, there's a couple of mounts for fixing it to whatever it is you want to fix it to. Mine will be going onto my helmet. This is uh, quite a nice mount. You can circle it around. I haven't actually fitted any of these on obviously yet, but I only had a quick look at it, but you get uh, a bag with some um, the actual fixtures, I suppose, to the, you know, for me to be my helmet. Uh, you get this one, which is a curved one and a straight one as well. So uh, I will use the uh, curved one on my bike helmet. 
um, and then obviously whenever, wherever that's fixed on the helmet, um, these just just with obviously with the camera fitted onto it, and they will just slide into place, and that's it, good to go. So let's take that back off. So yeah, so you get two of those. And of course, you get a USB for charging and things. Uh, another um, screw and a little rubber thing. I call it rubber thing. I genuinely don't know what it is or what it's for. It's probably got some really, you know, probably got a really good use, but I don't actually know what it is. But I'll read up the instructions in a minute. Check it out. Of course, you get a battery. A very very small battery. And uh, another thing for the back, like a, a, a back cover. And uh, this one's actually got these two, if you can make them out, like two little like holes in it. Uh, I think that's to let better audio in. So I'm going to move that out of the way for a second and just focus on the camera. So with the camera, um, obviously you've got obviously, yes, you know, a waterproof casing, which will be very handy. Um, to open it, you just pop this back, and then it should uh, should pop out. And uh, on the actual camera, there's these three uh, three buttons, so you can still access all the stuff from the um, like in the menus and everything, even with the casing on. And that's the camera itself. This is a uh, 10 megapixel camera. Um, on the you can see there's the the uh, take a photo or video uh, button, the mode and power button, and then here there is a Wi-Fi button as well. Um, there's the, the, you can actually fit little screens on the back of this, but I'm not gonna bother with that, because um, I've got the app on my phone, um, so I can see what the camera can see from the app, which I'll probably do a video on that at a later date. Um, yeah, pop the back off. And get the battery. The battery's actually got a really cool little, like, uh, flicky tag on it, so you can just pull it out when you finish with it, or when you know, when you need it. And uh, there we go. Fix it in there. Oops. Just turned it on. Obviously, I don't have a SD card, so I'll turn it off for a second. There we go. Yeah, I don't actually have a. Uh, my SD card hasn't came yet, which is disappointing, but then it doesn't bother me because I can't ride it yet anyway. Um, I won't be riding probably till Tuesday, um, which is a pain, but you know, I'm not going to moan about it. And uh, oh, yeah, as well, also on here, it also got there's also the um, little panel on the side, I'll take that off, and you can see there's the uh, micro SD card slot, uh, mini HDMI, and uh, the microphone port. You have to actually have an adapter, which I've ordered, and you plug the adapter into it, then you get the 3.5, which plugs into the adapter, and uh, what I'll end up doing with this is I'll probably, because I will stick to using my waterproof with it, I will leave the side off, and we'll probably drill a little hole into the side there. Um, so that I can get the um, the port, the plug-in, and then I'll probably try and find a way to seal it in, like a little bit of rubber or something like that, to keep it in place. Um, and then I'll probably bounce off another waterproof one as well for when I'm just kind of riding about. So yeah, and obviously then it will fit back into the back into the waterproof housing. And uh, yeah, my bike is actually a bit annoying actually. This morning, this came at like, I really needed a lion. I've been working really hard lately. Um, haven't had a day off or anything like that. And I desperately needed a break. And um, to, today was my only day off. And the, at about five past eight this morning, it sounded like the door was gonna be like kicked down by the uh, postman. And I didn't get there in time. And what he'd done is he literally just left this around the back of my house. Um, didn't post a note through or anything like that, just put it around there and left it. And um, 
because I'm not using my bike at the moment, it's actually in a garage, um, having some repairs done to it and um, you know, having a full service and everything like that. For them to leave it around the back, I wouldn't have actually gone out the back door because my car was out on the front. <laughs> so I would have found this. Um, it probably would have been robbed or something like that and I would have not known any different. So, um, but I got it anyway and it's all good. I'm really, you know, it's really small little camera which is nice. I don't know how I'm going to mount it yet. I'll now have a bit of a mess around with that and find out what's best. Um, but yeah, just a quick look at the GoPro Hero 3, what you get in the box and um, said if you do anything and you need an action camera I'll definitely say to get one of these. Um, I think the other, com the closest thing that would be good would be uh, the uh, Movie HD. Uh, they're meant to be really, really good as well, and they're a lot cheaper. Um, so yeah, that's it, guys. I hope you've enjoyed this. Like I said, any any questions, feel free to post in the comments below. And I will be doing some uh, moto vlogging. I think I get my bike back on Tuesday. By then, my helmet will be. This will be fixed to my helmet. My start. My SD card will be fitted and um, I will actually wear this to go pick up my bike and to go on a bit of a bit of a rag on it so I'll get a video up um, later in the week of that so yeah cheers for watching guys hope you've enjoyed it and uh, yeah I'll speak to you soon